Welcome to the Washington, D.C. Market Watch, brought to you by Real Estate Business Intelligence, an MRIS company. Let's take a quick look at the most recent numbers for housing market activity in the nation's capital. The national economy continues to show signs of improvement, but the pace of economic recovery is anemic at best. In May, the U.S. added 69,000 jobs, considerably lower than economists expected, and the April jobs number was also revised downward. This put the brakes on the unemployment rate's previous declines and pushed it up slightly to 8.2 percent in May. While national job growth has been slow, all recent gains have been in the private sector. From May 2011 to May 2012, the U.S. added 1.8 million new jobs, with growth in all sectors except the government and information sectors. The local economy is experiencing steady improvement. The unemployment rate in the district fell to 8.3 percent and over the past 12 months the city has added 7,200 resident workers. Activity in the Washington DC housing market is on the rise though inventory remains very low. Sales volumes are climbing for the fourth consecutive month and are 4.4 percent higher than this time last year. And while new contract activity has leveled off, it's still 4.5 percent above the May 2011 volume, indicating overall growth in market activity. Active listings are 34 percent lower than May of last year. In fact, the 1,614 active listings at the end of May represent the lowest May level inventory seen since 2005. At $450,000, the median sale price remains essentially unchanged from last month, but is up 4.9% from May 2011. Average days on market fell to 48 days, down from 67 days in May of last year. If market demand continues to increase as evidenced by rising contract activity and decreasing days on market, combined with low inventory, the laws of supply and demand tell us prices will have no choice but to increase in the coming months. With the observed growth trends in the D.C. housing market, things are looking up as we approach the second half of 2012. From the buyer's perspective, the low inventory is creating an incentive to act more quickly, as evidenced by the drop in average days on market and year-over-year -year gains in median sale price. That's the Washington, D.C. Market Watch for this month. Check back next month for the latest.